There are three different personalities in this group. One of us is really naughty um, and a bit mischievous. The other one likes to think she's the boss, but isn't. <laughs> and me, well, I guess I'm just me. When we're not busy working and stuff, we like to unwind and sit at home, listen to music and just do normal stuff, really. And if we're feeling a bit energetic, then we'll go shopping. The style of our music is R&B, pop. Um, I suppose it is that, really. We love pop music and that's how we see our music. It's such a privilege to be on Stars in Their Eyes tonight and be the people that we're going to be tonight, mainly because our parents have grown up listening to their music and so through them we've had to listen to their music and they're huge and everybody loves them and we've even met one of them, which is even more exciting, so we're really, really looking forward to it. Seven top tens to their name and that name is The Honeys! <laughs> Hello, honey. Hello, lovely. Oh, what a treat to have you here. Now, you lovely to be here. have been in the business for a few years now, and the girls who would die to follow in your footsteps, they would just love it. What advice would you give them? Um, it's a lot of hard work, a lot of hard work, a lot of travelling, a lot of losing a lot of sleep and stuff like that. But, mm. you know, we love it. We can't mm. complain. But now that you're kind of in this position, are you still starstruck, though? Oh, yeah. Yeah. At one time, we did get really starstruck when we met the wonderful Motown legend Lionel Richie. Lionel Richie, mm -hmm. you love this boy. We do, we oh, love yeah, him. We do. Did you work with him? <laughs> we we did. did. We were asked to sing with him in Italy and to do Endless Love, but Dinah Ross is part of the song. And so we were really, really flattered to do that. It's amazing. Oh. You should have seen us. I mean, I'm, I'm serious, like, this is like three girls like that. We were like this, you know, shaking. We've never sang. Couldn't sing. A yeah. bit like now, really. <laughs> 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 because we had to rehearse with his band, with his live band, and obviously someone who had to stand in for Mr. Lionel Richie. And we were like, where's Lionel? Yeah, where's, where's Lionel? Lionel? Where's Lionel? Lionel? And, you know, all you could hear, and you, you had this big voice come out, Hello, uh, is, is it me you're looking for? for? Like, oh, <laughs> He real. just walked out and we were like, oh, my God. Oh, my so Lord. We were yeah. so nervous. Yeah. But... Fabulous. And that is a little bit of a clue, isn't mm -hmm. it, to the uh, people that you're going to be tonight. So mm -hmm. tell me a bit more about this group. Well, they formed in Detroit mm -hmm. and signed to Motown in 61. And the first name was actually The Primet. And when we first started The Honeys, we were compared to them and we're going to sing their second number one single called Baby Love. Tell us who you're going to be, girls. <laughs> Tonight, Matthew, we're going to be the Supreme. The Supreme! Yeah. R&B becomes Motown as tonight, singing live, the hobbies are the
Oh, my girls. Oh, my girls. <laughs> well, you see, I understand that. I can see why Lionel Richie was so impressed with you. Oh, thank you. Uh, really? <laughs> no, honestly, it is absolutely sensational. And I'm so impressed with you girls. And I'm not surprised you've been compared to the Supremes as well. It's lovely. Ladies and gentlemen, the Honeys as the Supremes. Thank you, girls.